Hi everybody, I hope you are well and ready for another story time. Um, some of you might have received your packs already and some will, all of you might probably get them by the end of the day. So then we'll be doing videos that will correspond to the, the activities in your pack. But for the meantime, we're going to just do some stories. So today's story is called Bertie the Helpful Bus. This story is one of my little boys, Kieran's favorite favorites. Um, he's had it since he was a tiny boy and I've read it a thousand times. <laughs> so let's start. In the yard one sunny day, a bright red bus came out to play. Hello, said Thomas. Who are you? I'm Bertie. I take people too. Pleased to meet you. Bertie said, let's race for fun. We'll see who's really number one. You'll never beat a bus like me. Thomas whistled. Wait and see. I'm getting ready to race. Thomas and Bertie's race was on. And seconds later, they were gone. Bertie's engine reached top speed. He raced ahead into the lead. Bertie says, you can't catch me. Hurry, hurry, Thomas said, but his driver pointed straight ahead. Here's the crossing, don't forget. We'll beat that cheeky Bertie yet. Goodbye, Bertie. I wonder who's going to win the race. But Bertie found another route and beeped at Thomas. Toot, 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 toot. He crossed the bridge to take first place. Was Bertie going to win the race? Oh, Bertie's taking the lead. Let's see. Then Thomas whooshed into a tunnel as clouds of steam poured from his funnel. See you later, Thomas cried, to Bertie racing by his side. Beep, beep. Thomas came first. He had won the race while Bertie Bus took second place. He didn't moan or cause a fuss. What a kind and friendly bus. That was a fun race. Both Thomas and Bertie give people rides. They know they work best side by side. When passengers get off Thomas's train, Bertie takes them home again. What a really useful pair. And as you can see, Kieran has snuck into my video. <laughs> because when he listens to this story, it makes him very, very happy. It's one of his favorite books. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll see you soon. And sending much, much, much love. Say bye. Bye.